Hello and welcome to our comparison of the Idle Cosmos to the Zen and Zen Soul. The Zen has been the reigning big symmetric pearl ball across the three brands pretty much since it came out a year and a half ago, and while the Zen Soul is a hybrid, the Cosmos has a stronger cover formula than either one of the Zens, plus a very similar strength of core, so we're going to see how these all stack up and whether or not they can coexist. Starting with the Zen in shiny form, this is what I want to show because it only recently transitioned to the 4K fast surface out of the box. The vast majority of people watching this know the shiny Zen. We don't need to spend much time here. You've seen it, most of you have thrown it, you know about the Zen. As the modern day Marvel Pearl, it's strong, rolly, consistent, versatile, forgiving, just about every buzz and hype word you can think of, this ball is it. Moving on to the new Zen, the Zen Soul, which is just a hybrid Zen, it's the same cover formula and core as the other two. I said in the review that I think it's almost a better Zen. Now keep in mind that this is judging box surface Soul versus box surface Zen, original, remember shiny Zen. I think with the Zen now coming at 4K fast that they're going to be quite a bit closer together out of the box, but again, most people still have shiny Zens. The Soul is that same great Zen shape, but earlier and smoother, so I think that makes it even more controllable and versatile. The Soul is Angel's favorite of the three Zens, and it's pretty easy to see why. Now, it's definitely strong. It handles missing outside better than it does missing inside. The original Zen has limits, and when it's not the ball, it's really not the ball, but when it's matched up, I think the Soul can still hang... Uh, plus, it doesn't quite have the fall off the Zen does when it's not the ball. Now, again, the Zen's obviously a monster. I'm not meaning to knock it or try to hype the soul at all. This is just my examination of the ball reaction. And honestly, it's not a huge difference. Uh, it's subtle but effective. Next, with the Cosmos, it's technically the stronger ball, but it's also smoother. So when there's a higher volume on the lanes, it's going to look like the stronger ball because the Zen and the Soul don't have the same amount of traction. Now, when it's a little bit lower than that, the Zen and Soul will be able to keep up or even look stronger because they're quite a bit more responsive. And given the friction, they'll move. The Cosmos is smoother than the Zen and the Soul, but sharper or faster than the Zen Master. And the strength is so close that it's really going to depend on the conditions to create some separation. I think the Meditate Core in the Zens also rolls heavier and wants to slow down a little faster. So from an aggregate perspective, uh, the Zen, Soul, and the Cosmos are all fairly similar. The Cosmos is rounder, the Zen and Soul are more of an arc, so slight shape difference, but they are all obviously in a very similar zone. If you like Angel's jerseys, Rose Doll 10 gets you 10% off your order at checkout at Coolwick. The code's in the description to copy and paste. Follow my Bowler Smart link in the description for your bowling needs. That associates your purchases with me, which helps me out quite a bit, so thanks for using that. Check out the SRG BBFS group on Facebook for all things SPI, and of course, thanks to Turbo and especially Storm for keeping us in equipment to show off to everyone. Also, the new super thanks button below the video on the line with the like and share buttons allows you to leave me a tip. Other than that, I don't want you. I want her, the one who hit the ball. You can climb back under the cow. Final verdict. They're too close to have all three unless you like stuff in that zone and want shape compliments. Angel favors stuff like this, so she's going to be carrying around the Soul and Cosmos plus other somewhat similar stuff. The Cosmos releases July 8th. Look for other videos leading up to release date. But for now, thanks Storm, Turbo, Bowler's Mart. Remember to follow that link in the description to get this thing ordered. Coolwick and SRGBBFS, thank you for watching and may the strikes be with you.